Hi guys, I am back to metal detecting the beach today. Coming in here, my one of my home beaches here in Huntington Beach, California. This is Bolsa Chica State Beach. Uh, that's the campground right here. And those fire pits I haven't hit in a very, very, very long time. I've been hitting the fire pits all the way down there. I did that uh, the last time it was really slow on the swells. I'm going on my third week of no gold, even though you guys see I dig a lot of gold. However, it has been three weeks since I've actually dug gold. Okay, finally, I got my first good solid target right here. Sounds like a dime. I go for a silver ring. Is that it right there? Yeah. Okay, it is a penny. Okay, I'm getting closer to the water's edge just to take a look at the water. Got a lot of surfers out there, but I got rain coming this way. And I got that high tone right here. I hope it's a good one. Out. Sounds like a quarter. Oh, I see a quarter. Right there. Oh, wait. There might be more to it. Wait. All right, I got a dime and a quarter into this game. And yes, high tones are so much easier to dig out of fire pit slaw area. I got another high tone right here. Anywhere from 26 to 30. Twenty-five to twenty-seven. It's another dime. And you know what we'll do with that, right? That's right. But I will put it in my pints bag. <laughs> I'm just kind of doing a zigzag, and then I'll walk down to the fire pits. But I could tell this area has not been metal detected in a long time. Maybe another dime right there. And it is getting chilly. Huh. Okay. I know. You guys live back east are just laughing at Jim, going, oh, Jim, it's like 30 something degrees and snow on the ground, guys. That's way too cold for me. Okay, I got a crazy signal over here, right there. I'm thinking there might be multiple items in here. That's a solid 13 right there. I'm thinking tool pad, maybe. Oh, no way. Wait! I have hit the cycle already. <laughs> Literally, guys. All right, my car still right over there. I mean, I, I've only I walked in on that straight line right there. So, and I've hit the cycle already. So that's a great start. Great start. I have no idea why I just shut the camera off. I still have targets right here. It's probably garbage. Oh, that sounds way better. So, maybe another quarter right here. And that doesn't look like a quarter. Tug on it. It might be a coin though. But most likely not. All right, what do we got over here? Oh, you know what? That item probably wasn't in the quarter I was digging. Oh, Jim, how stupid can you get? Always double check your hole. I did. Good thing I did, right? <laughs> Next question is, what did I put in my finds bag? 
Look at that. It is a quarter. I almost got a buck already, guys. That's fantastic. It's a little broken up too. Quiet. I see a detector is down there in the wet. I think he's fishing and detecting. That's pretty cool. And look, another quarter. And now over a dollar. So this is where I dug a couple of nickels and quarters at right here. And then right next to it, right over here. Nice high toe for another quarter. Is that it right there? Yeah, I like it. That is so many targets right around here. You know, they do a lot of parties on this beach, so sometimes you'll find little pockets areas where you find a whole bunch of stuff. But mainly it's bottle caps that you find. <laughs> That sounds like it could be a penny or bottle cap or slaw. I think I need a film of would you dig it out here too. Oh yeah, look at that slaw. Alright, let's go ahead and remove that garbage from the beach too. So I'm still in this little area right here and I got a solid 22 right here. Usually a copper penny. And my scoop. Oh. I think I just saw a coin right here. Oh, is that a token? Hold on, let me grab the trash and get it out. Yeah. A token of some sort. It's probably one of the state beach tokens. Okay. All right. Before I turned on the GoPro, this was a solid 12-13. Okay. And good. It stayed the same. The last like several digs, I've I've sounded just like 12-13s, and then I turn on the GoPro and they shoot all over the place like it's something else. And do you see any metal? Yeah, well, unfortunately, that's what you find a lot of. I find a lot more of that than I do of coins, that's for sure. And that is going to be the same thing, I think. Whoa. This sounds like a dime or penny. So I got a cool tab there, or a nickel. Alright, everything's quiet. Hopefully I have two items in the scoop. Hopefully they're both good. Well, we can see one item is good, one item isn't. Alright, that's the not good, and here is the good. And it's a dime. All right. You know, I love getting paid to do this hobby. It's wonderful. It really is. Now, if I get Mind Lab to pay attention to my channel, it'd be great. Okay, guys, I got another real high tone right here. Where'd it go? Okay. I think I see an outline of a rim right there. Yeah, another quarter. All right, sweet. Love that. Okay. I got so many quarters in this small area. I love the fact this area has not been detected. Or people just get so frustrated they can't detect this beach. That's one of the frustrating parts about
must be really small. Oh jeez. Yeah. All right. What do we got here? All right. Let's just throw stuff out. I'm tired of dealing with everything. That's iron. All right. Oh, what is that thing? <laughs> it's a ring. Are you freaking kidding me? All right, hold on. It may be a, a, a spill of some sort. Hold on. Let me just stick this uh, in my coat pocket. All right, I just put that ring in my coat pocket. Let's see what else is here. Okay, throw that out. Be a big chunky gold. Come on. That's a different target altogether. That sounds like a solid 20. I'd go for a big old chunk of gold. Come on. Ah, I got a penny. Okay, let's take a look at that ring. But actually, let's see what this target is right here. I do believe that's going to be bottle cap, but you know, I'm going to have to dig it now. Oh, that sounds like bottle cap. That doesn't have that crisp sound that a gold ring would have. Yeah, see? Okay. I think I cleared out this area pretty good. Let's take a look at this ring. Oops. Ooh, that could be gold. That could be gold. A 10. Usually, gold ring that size would be a lot heavier. I'm thinking it's stainless steel. And I'm hoping I'm wrong. And I don't have my loop with me. So, in the finds bag, it goes. All right. I'm thinking, I'm hoping for gold, but I think that's stainless, guys. Uh, you know, I found enough rings over the years to... Uh, the, the weight of gold is undeniably good. But I've been shocked before. Oh. So many darn targets. Ooh, that sounds good, but why'd it change on me? Well, that's different. Definitely a bottle cap, right? Maybe something different. Oh no, it's a bottle cap. And some wood. Okay. Fill this hole in. This has uh, been a struggle right here. Look who that crazy guy is right there. All right, I got a high tone right here too. Super high tone. Come on, silver ring. I just dug a ring. Are you serious? And I've dug so many quarters in this little area, it's crazy. What kind of ring again? Huh? What kind of ring, silver? I think it's, uh, I'll show it to you. It looked goldy for a second, but I think it's stainless steel because of the weight. All right, got another quarter. I'm hoping one of these high tones is a silver ring at some point. I know I've already got a ring, but... That's yeah, not going to be any ring. Okay. All right, Alex hit the wet sand and is going down towards the jetty. He, uh, he heard rumors about good stuff being found over there. Hmm. Oh, it is an earring. I don't think it's anything fancy, but it, look, it's got a backing on it. <laughs> yeah, it's been there for a while. 
You know, I'm always amazed when you find an earring that it still has a backing on it. So, you know, they took it off before they went out in the ocean and then that's when they lost it. I saw the rim of this bottle cap right here and it went nuts for a second. Good thing it wasn't on camera. <laughs> okay, I got another target right here. Man, sounds like a tent stake. Out. Sounds like a dime now. And then go right back in the hole. I think I see a coin right there. Penny? Yeah. Okay. I love it. I can't believe how many targets are here right now. You see, I haven't moved very far. Just being kind of thorough. The way I normally detect. Yeah, but, I, you know, Alex didn't last long up here. It will drive a normal person insane and an insane person even more insane. And then if you're like me, you've, you've already lost it. So it doesn't matter anymore. With all the garbage in the ground, thank gosh for high tones, right? Seriously, this is a great one right here. I love the 33s, the 34s. Twenty-nine thirty out of the hole. Damn my scoop. Ooh, the wrist did not like that move. Look at that. Is that a piece of metal? No. All right, another quarter. It's my second coin in this area that I detected that just been sitting right on top. And you find any fishing weights? One of them on the surface. One on the surface. So fresh drop. Yeah, fresh drop. For yeah. Sure. Yeah, check this out. What'd you get? No, I just wanted to show you. It's not what I get, it's the accumulated of what I've got in just this area. Ready? Holy shards. So there's shit here, dude. You just gotta dig it up. And look, you can see where I've dug. Right. I, and I am literally just trying to find good targets, trying not to dig bottle caps or anything like that. Okay, got another high tone and almost a dead battery. And, and Alex is getting hungry again, so we're probably going to go get some hot off the grill here pretty soon. So I'm going to dig this quarter right now. And I'm praying that it's, uh, you know, like a silver ring. Silver ring. I would like to find. It's been three weeks since I found some uh, gold. That three weeks. Three weeks. Well, that's all the humanity. Yes, I know. I might need to get a psychiatrist or something. And there is another here, quarter. Here's your new shovel. <gasps> oh, thank you. Your new shovel. Get the dick with yeah, that. that's a crevice. You have to, you have to, you have to, you have to, when you, when you go gold mining next, you have to. Back at the rocks, and you have to find yeah, the gold with that. Little plastic crevicing tool. Thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. I'll throw it away for you. No problem. <laughs> Anyways, you ready to go get some food? Hey, Alex. Look at that. So, do you think you could polish off all no. of that before I finish my taco? <laughs> Please, I'm really close. I'm going to start. Go. I'm going to help you. This is an oh, octopus, Lord. right? Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. You think if I'm eating this seafood and I go detect the wet sand, they might get revenge? I don't know, man. Okay guys, here's the wrap up. Can you believe it just turned five o'clock and it's this dark? Look at this. 
I, I, I hate it when it's this dark, guys. I, I need my summertime hours again. I, I'm Five o'clock, it should be nice and sunny out to me. Anyways, look at all the trash that I dug. Of course, this fire pit slaw is brutal stuff. You guys know what I mean, all right? Especially if you've ever detected near fire pits. I did not get any gold today. I got something gold plated. But anyways, look at this, guys. I got... 13 quarters, so three dollars and 25 cents in quarters. I got 12 dimes, so a dollar 20 in dimes. I got four nickels hitting the cycle at least four times. Five copper pennies. I love digging more quarters than I do pennies. But guys, trying to decipher between fire pit slaw and everything else, quarters are nice high tones, dimes are nice high tones. So it's obvious that's what I dug and had the most success on, right? Anyways, I found a Bolsa Chica State Beach token. I shouldn't even pick that up because you guys can't even see it because there's no light there. And I got this little bling earring with the backing on it. It is going to be gold plated at one time. And that is going to be a stainless steel men's wedding band type ring. Anyways, I got a ring out of this weird, weird day. And I pulled out a lot of clad. So it was all in all a fantastic day. Okay, guys. Haley says it's time to select the winner of last week's Would You Dig It? Okay, guys. I got one here for you. And, of course, you know I went with a low tone today, right? <laughs> Would you dig it? And if you would dig it, comment below what you think it is and you'll have a chance to win a $25 Amazon gift card. Guys, I'm gonna go 90 degrees right here. All right, we'll go back. Okay guys, let's dig this one up. It's a platinum ring. Okay guys, now it's time to select the winner of last week's Would You Dig It? I'm going to my TubeBuddy app. I'm selecting pick a winner. Comment must contain the words platinum. Pick a winner. Steve Annermatt. Small platinum ring is my guess for the Would You Dig It? Well, congratulations, Steve. Send me an email. You can find that in the About Me section of my channel page, and I will send you out your $25 Amazon gift card. And guys, don't get discouraged. I have another Would You Dig It? contest giveaway happening right now for another $25 Amazon gift card. So let's take a look at this one. Okay, guys, I have another Would You Dig It? contest giveaway for a $25 Amazon gift card that we will select in next Thursday's video right here, guys. So I'm not really sure what this is, but I have a good guess of what it really is. So let's take a look. I am in Beach 1, and I'm at 18 sensitivity because there's a lot of high EMI around here. Because if you look, I'm right near the power plant. Oh, but I got a target right here in the dry sand as I was walking out. Would you dig it? Let's go 90 degrees. Oh gosh. It doesn't sound good anymore, huh? Funny how it sounds different. Anyways, guys. Would you dig it? If you would dig it, comment below what you think it is and you'll have a chance to win a $25 Amazon gift card that we will select in next Thursday's video. All right, guys, one more time. Would you dig it? I dug it. Would you dig it? And if you would dig it, comment below what you think it is and you'll have a chance to win a $25 Amazon gift card that we will select in next Thursday's video. And guys, if you like my videos, please click like. If you want to see more, consider subscribing, ringing this bell, and receive all the notifications every time I release a new video. And please take a look at this video right here.